let's go ahead and start. This is Metroid Sub-Zero by Connor. We'll see the story in a second. This is actually the second attempt at recording this, so I've actually already played this. Uh, but yeah, the stream and recording broke, so we're redoing it. Um, but yeah, Sub-Zero, pretty much uh, Deep Freeze 2, definitely copied me. We're going to be trying to do low percents, it's like I said, we already did this. And I already know uh, where all the items are. So uh, yeah, let's go ahead and jump into it. We have Connor here today, but uh, he went to go do something real quick. Hello. Oh, there he is. Hopefully you can hear him, right? I did not check the audio computer. So. Hopefully he sounds good. And then there, there's your story. Good stuff. Hi, Sirgly. Then uh, we have a cutscene here. <laughs> so a lot of people complain about it because they don't know what's happening. And there you go. Whole planet froze in front of us. So let me try to remember what we need. I don't even know if we actually... Yeah, we probably have to get items since we don't get the still in here. So we'll go there. And uh, we start with Long Beam. And there we go, we have high jump. Uh, so yeah, I, I was giving Connor crap yesterday because Deep Freeze, uh, had this, uh, high jump as the first item. Definitely copy. Oh yeah, you can't extend the cutscene. I did that when I first played, uh, Cowie, because I didn't know what was happening. I thought I was, like, stuck in a wall. Also, he's using unfrozen sobas as enemies, also copying the degrees. Is it? And screes. What are you gonna say, Connor? What? Cut out when you started asking whatever question. Oh, in does Deep Freeze uh, use sobas? Yeah, they use like, uh, they're like more whitish than uh, blue, though. So this will probably be the only missile pack we get. Well, this will be, because we be more. Better. Low percent. No tin missile doors here. Oh, well, you don't really need more missiles. Yeah, you only need them to open the doors. So I've got to remember a morph ball is. I think it's in the room. Um. By the way, that that glitch in the in the intro that you. Can escape. Oh, it's fixed. Oh, it's, what? It's, like, well, it's fixed in the version you're playing. Oh, okay. The problem was that I put a slope there that you could grab on. Yeah, I'm playing this one or pack again, one of. Mainly because, uh, yeah, you saw the stream yesterday was Garbo, and then the recording broke, so <laughs> here we are again. We're doing low percent this time around, see what it is. So, we probably need to get the Storm Suit next. Let's see if we can get Supers. Then what, Plasma? I think that's it. That's a, that, that's a Plasma block right by the Super, right? Connor? Um... You need the storm suit, then. Well, if you could uh, sequence break to the super missile, you wouldn't need bombs and uh, space tram. Yeah, yeah. I was just asking if the the block that is at the super missile that's a plasma yeah, block. Yeah, that's, right? that's a plasma block. Remember where to go. No, I should put I should put a space tram block behind that. And. Sequence break as much as possible. I don't know if there's any other really sequence breaks other than that one. I'm about to skip. In the first version, there was um, a way to get space trump early. 
Alright, we're playing the first version. No. <laughs> Alright. Uh, definitely don't want to try that. What do you think? Didn't even do it with two. You're obviously only playing because you like the hex so much, and you need to copy ideas for um deep freeze, deeper too. freeze, deeper freeze for Metroid deeper freeze for shallow melts. <laughs> yes. Oh. Wow! Can't power grip an enemy. Bad. This way, right. Also say if we should use that. Wow. Amazing. Amazing gameplay. Wait for me, Silva. I shot you so I wouldn't get hit. I'm gonna die. GG. In an effort to get health, I lost more. Feels bad, man. I'll fall on him. Storm suit should be down here. Wow, multi man. I gave this act one for Bing me. Also, potential soft lock you should fix. Look. Well, yeah, I know. Ah, oh, I'm soft locked. Well, yeah, if you shoot your missiles now, you're soft locked. Yeah. <laughs> but I mean, what retard would do that? <laughs> e. Epic. Alright, now let's see if we can uh, make that spiker one eat tank. We should save first. Of course, of course. You're going to the wrong room. Hey, don't worry about where I'm going, Connor. <laughs> Just to uh, get the video to be at least 10 minutes to get that sweet ad revenue. Alright. It's all a ploy. You chump. Save. I am doing 100%, yeah. Let's see what it is. But Connor's gonna remove the freaking sequence breaks. So the be the same. Add. Literally, Drusif. All name, please. Well, I'm removing the sequence break because some people are retarded and would think that that's the um, correct route, maybe. No! Ah, uh, yeah, I messed that one up pretty bad. I think it's doable. Very low energy. But I gotta save after that, and you don't need to do it ever again. Nope, we're doing it again. Well, yeah, but after you beat it once. Oh, yeah. Well, I'll have to do it on the way back, but that'll be much easier. Uh, no, because you can... Oh, no, you don't... Oh, no, wait, you don't need bombs for that. Oh, man. Uh, that's close. It might be if I would've hit that wall jump with this when I tried to do it. Yeah, it's called a fan one of... Nothing I can really do about that, it's a really loud fan. What happens when you live with people? Alright, round three, I think. No! No! Oh, uh, yeah, that's it. Gosh dang it, dude. Just... No. 
me good at game. At least you're not constantly hearing it though, one of. I made sure I can't hear it unless I'm talking. Oh, okay. Dang it, if I could just make that wall jump. Definitely do it. It's so annoying. <laughs> Stupid spike. Connor, this hack is trash. I know, right? Having spikes. The hard mode is going to be fun. Too hot for too cold mode. I don't know if the spikes actually do more damage in hard mode, though. Oh. Yay. <laughs> Yay. Oh man, I, for I thought there was a real scree up there. I was like, no. Better <laughs> die. Alright. <clears throat> oh wow. <laughs> We're gonna have to make sure we get some energy on the way back. Well. You know there's the <sighs> hidden passage, don't you? I do not, nah, I guess I'm oh, gonna have to yeah. look for that. <laughs> On the way, cause when I did it the first stream, remember I just jumped to the spikes again? But yeah, this is a space, not space jump, a plasma block. But we just need to get pla- I think- No, I guess Ridley wouldn't be immune, so other beams, but that would kind of suck if someone could actually manage to skip Plasma. With all the health he gave him. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so there's a secret That's passage in the next room. Like this bike room. Uh, it's in the safe room. Oh, yeah, that's that's a passage, okay. Right, how about that? Well, the problem is, I'm missing a super block. Oh, I don't need it for the second one. Interesting. You only need two if you come from this side. Well, you need one to get back. But the um, violas give you supers. They drop supers a lot. So, remind me, the plasma's through the other heater one, right? Base jump is the, down the elevator. Base jump is uh, with bombs, and bombs are down the elevator. Plasma is uh, in the remember starting room. Starting room. Oh yeah, I remember. That's not for sure. Let's see what this uh, down there. So yeah, if. Uh... Like getting the low percent image is, is impossible. Should give you a tweak to change the threshold. Oh really? I, I don't have a low percent image because it's impossible. Uh <clears throat> but I could add um if you find the tweak for uh, that. I found it before, like I used it for research. It was. Alright, that should be the last item we're getting. At least gonna uh, well, I guess you could morph in that little spot, but it's not even taking short. Uh, what do you mean? There's a shortcut from the big hub room into the starting room. Maybe I don't want to take. That's so full of fell. Do I see that? <laughs> where are you going? Do you mean where I'm going? Not the right way. <laughs> Wow. You should make uh, the friendly enemies do like 50 damage on hard mode. It, would it be possible to let them do no damage? Because if you set the damage on... 
Alright, like to, to zero, it, they still do one damage. There's a probably a hex streak I can find for each enemy that will just let you ignore your collision. Oh, the collision, that would be even better. Yeah, and then you can just walk through. The Scree was still trying to attack you, though. In the wrong room. Hey, I can see that. Just it's just so much like deep freeze, you know. I'm getting confused. Yeah, <laughs> I'm getting confused when I play deep freeze. Like the world is really weird. Shortcut. I way. think that's mostly due to the map being like completely black. <laughs> but yeah, that's fair. It looks cool though. That's yeah. what matters. Makes it harder to yeah. You actually need to look at the map. Alright, can we first try Wrigley without being bad? Ow. That doesn't work. Well, you want to go into that position when he starts swooping with his uh, tail. Oh! Then he can't hit you there. Yeah, you bad! Which sound? <laughs> I could just hear the flame sound. Where he's spewing fire. <laughs> Why are you mad at me? <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> oh, you don't have space jump, right? <laughs> <laughs> Dang it! <laughs> I'm trying to farm health, but I guess that's not worth it. Why was there the f the fame sound? I don't know. It just kept going. Wow, MSC spoiling himself. The heck! Oh yeah, <laughs> fireball hit me. <laughs> um, I was trying to get him to land on the ground. Seems like a good strat, dude. <laughs> get out of here. Okay. <laughs> yeah, but in, in normal zero motion it's lava. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, what I meant. Oh, it's the, the British. Oh, you mean? Yeah. I, I thought you were being glitches high now. No. no oh my closer. gosh. Okay, glitch. Just, like, shoot at him as he spits the fireballs. Then he flies up, shoot at him diagonally at that point. And then when he starts swooping his tail, you need to go into Morphle and stay on the ice. And then he can hit me when he swoops his tail. No, he can't. Dude, he I was can't. doing I mean, it. I it's already no, you, been hit. You did it wrong, okay? I can do it all the time. I'm gonna prove to you that he can hit me. Oh my goodness, what is oh, happening? Oh boy. What are you doing? I don't know what happened there. No, you need to shoot diagonally at him first. What are you saying? Like, after... At the moment he flies up, you, look, you need his to... tail's gonna hit me. Oh. No, it's not. Now look, wait. It, it hit me hit last you. time. <laughs> wait, because you're bad. No mothball. That's a dumb strat. I swear it hit me last time when I was here. Cause he can get really low to the ground when he does it. Wow, oh, bad. This is a lame strat like mine. Yeah, you can also, as he's swooping, um, just wait when he, uh, like, puts his tail back, jump with your mouth ball out of it, and then go behind him. That's a bad strat. I think you should patch that. Wow? You patch a sequence break, but you won't patch a G strat. What kind of hacker are you? How long is it supposed to patch that? Where's the, where's the snow gun? It melted. Oh. And now these are friendly enemies that still deal damage. How rude. I should find I should just get hit a hundred times to die to these guys. That would be real.
Why are those rippers attached to wires? Because they're flying in the air and they don't want it to be unfair. <laughs> right? Imagine not knowing the story of a hack you haven't played. Gosh. It's basically deep freeze. <laughs> <laughs> Is this hack set? Enemies. Hey, that's what he said. These are supposed to be friendly enemies. <laughs> deep of freeze creatures. I said creatures. Yeah, bro. Well, friendly enemies are like that. I like that uh, terminology better. <laughs> the friendly enemies. <laughs> <clears throat> Ship doesn't know who Samus is in Morph Ball. Yeah, I changed the plasma beam text to say uh, you can melt the toughest ice blocks now because many people got confused there. <laughs> he thought he well, could if someone, ice. If someone could do ASM that lets me destroy spikes with plasma beam. That would be cool. That would make uh, a space jump even more ah, capable. No. Oh well, yeah, I guess since the space jump before it. Yes. Oh, it wasn't recording, gotta do it again. Oh. <laughs> now time to crash the ROM. Oh yeah, we're gonna show that off for sure. <laughs> Didn't even edit the credits. He didn't even put my name in every spot in the credits. Bad. Yeah, imagine not having the patience to go to the hex editor and edit each letter. <laughs> That's easy. You literally just type your name in and boom, your name's in the credits. Alex S is like the only person I know that edited the palettes. Uh, uh the, the credits. Special thanks to Mike, uh, yeah, thanks Mike. No scary noises, please. Thinking face. Mm. Imagine not fast forwarding the credits. My fast forward button is unbound. Sorry, it's bound to my slow down button, so it wouldn't really work. <laughs> I did that so I wouldn't I wouldn't ever use it. Alright, so now can I rate this one orb? Well Since well, there's no low percentage. Oh yeah, of course. Well, bad. <laughs> so this is the low percent. Let's see, forty-seven percent is low percent. <laughs> so I'm pretty the fat number. Oh, yeah, click on it. All right, let's crash the ROM real quick. Gotta let these play through. No, you don't need to. Just don't. need to get to the save screen. Oh. Alright, there you go, it crashed. <laughs> Opercent <laughs> failed. <laughs> On Connor's part. What? 